Hey guys, I'm GC Gaming today. And today we are going somewhere where the sirens are going. Let's continue. Hey, it's me. What's with the units heading down third? Looks like our old friend Herman Schultz is at it again. Shocker! Didn't he just get paroled? Yeah, well, guess it didn't take. No worries. Herman's just a big cupcake. I'll have him back in Rikers by bedtime. Huh, by bedtime. Ooh, web shooters. Nah, I think. I want to get my web shooters up. There we go, there we are. Just had dinner with my ex after saving her from masked criminals. And now I'm gonna go beat up a maniac who uses shockwaves to rob people. <laughs> what a perfectly normal life you have, Peter Parker. Attention units, need response to a break-in. Additional officers needed in time. Peter, I just want to make sure you haven't left any equipment you've built for your friend around the lab. It's no bother to me, but if the Grand Committee stops by again... Don't worry, Doc. I make a point not to leave anything there. But I know my friend appreciates you looking out for him. There's a lot of people who don't like him very much. That buffoon Jameson and his audience of sheep, please. The people who do great things in this world are those who don't let bullies like him stand in their way. People like us. You said a mouthful, Doc. Take care. Whoa. I guess I can um go to that surveillance one. I knew it, okay, shock on. Section, I think it is. There you go. This piece of the Shocker's original uniform showed me how to protect myself from his blasts. Of course, they always upgrade, don't they? Mm. Captain Watanabe gave me her cell number when she finally decided to trust me. She's risking a lot. If anyone finds out she's helping me, she'll lose her job. Nah. Well, then, gotta keep, that's why you always keep secrets. Let's keep you safe. Underarm webs. I thought they might help me glide short distances, but they never really worked. Looked cool though. Yeah. Wish, wish they did work, huh? Oh, Drug trade's gotten more aggressive post Fisk. I gotta stump that out. Ah, you guys are like little kingpins in training. So cute. Nothing 
something puts a pep in my step like halting an illegal drug deal. Nearby units advised. Witnesses hold in a mugging. Incident is ongoing near Union Square. Please copy. That's a hold up. Surprise! It's a spider! ending <laughs> All right, so I'm just getting this. Beautiful. Oh. oh there's something over there okay I got that some lot of stuff so far okay Nice. I always get the feeling something strange is going on in that place. Yeah. Yep, the strange is a uh, place. Just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone. Or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. Move, move, move! Zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? <laughs> Maybe later. There we go. Good work, Spider Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. 
Wow, that might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. <laughs> Looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> Hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah, whenever, whatever. I guess we're talking again. Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. I could patch these shoes. They'll last a while. I never used to feel safe at the other shelter. Peter, what can I do for you? I'm uh, sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. I thought the name of demon. Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. It scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Okay, then. Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Hmm. I'm gonna end it there and peace.